Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Bibi and in today's video, I'll show you how to get this makeup look done. So if you're interested, keep on watching. These are the products that I use to fill in my brows. And after wetting my face, I use the Pond's Vanishing Cream as a primer. I love using this cream as a primer because it grips my foundation very well and helps me stay matte all day. For foundation, I use the L'Oreal Paris 24 hour matte foundation in the color Mahogany and with a wet uh, flat top foundation brush, I will thoroughly buff it into my skin. I will buff it into my skin, paying special attention to the jawline so that I do not have any line of demarcation. Now, I'm just melting the foundation with a damp beauty sponge. To brighten and conceal my face, I use a concealer that is two to three shades lighter than my skin. I make sure that the concealer matches my undertone so that the foundation and concealer melt and blend seamlessly and with a real techniques setting brush that has also been dampened i will blend that concealer i place the concealer underneath my eyes on the top of my lips and the bridge of my nose these are the places that you want to brighten and conceal your face. I take my time blending because if you do not blend properly you will have a lot of lines of demarcation to melt the concealer and foundation together I now use my damp beauty sponge and to set the concealer in place I will use a large angled contour brush by stigma with some baby powder For the eyes, I will first use an eyeshadow primer. This eyeshadow primer is from Yushis. And with my middle, not my middle finger, my ring finger, I will thoroughly blend the primer before I use the stigma tapered blending brush with some neutral brown eyeshadow and place that eyeshadow all over my lid, my eyelids. I gradually add um, the eyeshadow so that I can reach the opacity that I desire and to darken my eyelids I will use an eyeshading brush from Stigma with the same eyeshadow and place it onto my eyelids. After that, I'll just brush off the excess powder that was where I placed the concealer and I will set my entire face with the Wet n Wild 
photo focus press powder in the color dark cafe i'll warm up my face with this powder and with a large shader brush by stigma i will lightly contour my nose To remove any line of demarcation, I'll use the large powder brush and wet my face and melt all the powder onto my skin with my damp beauty sponge. For mascara, I used the Essence False Lashes Mascara, the Extreme Volume and Curl version. I'll moisturize my lips with some Comex and place a bit of lipstick onto the middle of my bottom lips and then line my entire lips with the Catrice Brow Definer pen. I use this pen because um, I like using liquid lip liners and there are very few companies that actually produce this product After wetting my face, I'll then highlight my face with a highlighting stick. I'll highlight the top of my cheeks, my cupid's bow, my nose bridge, and my tear duct. My tear duct. The usual places that you actually highlight 